In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can very easily get your hands on some very rare materials that you might need for your next engineering modification. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Down to Earth Astronomy and to Elite Dangerous. As you may know, I'm currently working on engineering my Corvette. And for that, I'm going to need a lot of rare materials. And today we are talking about the rare um, atomic materials. We're not talking about um, the manufactured one. Um, I already have a video on that. So click the more info icon if you want to see that video. So today we're looking at, at the atomic materials only. Um, and what you're going to do is you're going to come by. There's actually several of these sites um, that I've heard of. Of these crashed anacondas and you come here and there will be some cargo racks you can shoot up um, and in these cargo racks they will have a very very high chance of spawning these rare materials so to find these you're gonna come to um, to a system called Ori or Ori or Ori or I'm not sure how that's pronounced um, but let's have a look at the system map you can see it here it will be in this description as well of course and you're gonna go to the second planet and go to the second moon. And on the second moon, you're gonna come into this uh, canyon. Um, it's always pretty dark down here, all the times I've been here. You can see the coordinates here on the screen. They will also, of course, be in the video description. Um, so, once you are here, what you're gonna do is... Move the handbrake. Open the cargo hatch. Once you found this crashed um, anaconda, gonna drive around to uh, to the back of it because around the back you can go to a contact panel and you will see these cargo racks so it's just over this small bump here it's very bumpy down here so it can be a little difficult to navigate but if you shoot these cargo racks oh you saw that a container came out let's see what we got okay so we were unlucky this time looks like the container was just tungsten let's pick it up anyway um, and once you have picked up the first one, you just continue moving in the same direction. And eventually you will see the next cargo rack. There it is. I'm just going to do the same thing. And there are a total of three of these cargo racks that I've been able to find. Um, hold on. There we go. Shoot that one up. See what we got this time. Ah, Tellurium. Perfect. Exactly what I need. That's one, and I think this was another one that spawned. Um, yeah, Sicorium. Not bad either. Let's pick that up too. And the last cargo rack is you continue away from the anaconda, around all these like destroyed parts, and you go up the hill behind it. And up here, there it is. Ah, come on. You'll see the last cargo rack. As you can see here... There we go. It can be a little difficult to navigate because of all the wreckage. Um, now I managed to get myself stuck here. But anyway, you get the point. <laughs> here we go. And once you've uh, collected all the materials from, uh, from the three cargo racks... More Siconium. And another thing. I think. No? Ah oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, it's crawling down uh, rolling down the hills behind us. Oh. I'm not very good at the SRV and this is a very, very difficult um difficult area to navigate. Luckily, it doesn't seem like the um, there's any clipping issues. It's not like you're gonna get stuck in uh, in the wreckage, but it is a little difficult to navigate. But this is basically it. And as soon as, as you can see, it can be difficult to pick up even. Um, but as soon as you got the materials you need, you're just gonna um, there we go. Then you're just gonna lock back to the main screen, go into another session. And you can redo the whole thing. All the cargo racks will be back um, where they were before. And you can do it again. Um, and that's uh, pretty much it. 
Um, very, very easy, and uh, the system is not that far out either. It's fairly, uh, things pretty close in the middle of the bubble, only like like hundred and something light years from uh, from Seoul, so it's not that bad. But anyway, I hope you found it useful. Um, if you did, give the video a like down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And until next time, I will see you guys in space.